you know how Chris Tucker did it. He wasn't trying to go back. He was dealing with Jackie Chan. Mm -hmm. Like, do you understand when somebody starts to evolve how it can be a complicated matter to go back to those roles because yeah. of where you're at in life and because of your not only your value, but right. your time. Right, right, right. Yeah, no, nah, it definitely could. You know what I'm saying? But that's why you just got to pick your battles. You got to pick the right stuff to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got to go back, but how far are you going back? You know what I'm saying? Like, like I, I, I'm going to work with all my people because fuck, he even gave me my, 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 my stepping stone to get to where I'm at right now. You know what I'm saying? Put me out there, show my face and introducing me, introducing me to the world. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. I know what I gotta ask you, man. Mm -hmm. Like, if you, like, like you see how uh, Beverly Hill Cops coming out mm -hmm. and they're, they're selling it to Amazon. Mm -hmm. Do you think that's the best way to go with it now versus, you know, uh, uh, Martin and them, they, Bad Boys brought a lot of money in through the theaters, bro. Yeah, that first so, weekend so, that made So I'm just like, five yeah, the million? money better. Streaming. Nah, no, nah, hundred. It was a hundred million. Nah, Stream is it first was weekend. Lot. Yeah. Okay. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't so you think you think Eddie's way of doing it might not be the way you would go with it? You well, you know, he probably got a better. Uh, he well, knows something, don't he? Because he, he did the, the same thing with coming to America right. too. Right, right, coming right, to America. Right. Yeah, he, he did on the same thing. He in a different. You know what I'm saying? Like he got so much input in that. Like me, I'm just an act. I'm just a talent. So, you know what I'm saying? It's like, it's so much I can do. You think he plugged in? He might know somebody over there. Yeah, like, I'm going to give you the bag. When you do game. this, yeah. I bet you they got a private He don't set. want the risk of, uh, you know, going big screen and you don't know if it's going to hit, you know. No, 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 no. I think he got somebody over because his shit going to hit. Beverly Hills Cop is yeah, going to hit. Gonna be he know that right. already. Coming to America was going to hit, but it was during COVID time. Right, so right. he had to do what he had to do. Yeah. But this one right here, somebody in there, I think he got a relationship to where he know he going to get his bread up front. Yeah, that's Eddie and, and he like, I'm going to go and do it this way. Yeah. I'm going to get 100 million or I'm going to get 20 million up front. Right, then right. I'm cool with it because that's all I'm kind of get out of it anyway. Right, right, right. Yeah, so I you could do it that way if you know him. somebody, like you said. Yeah, he in there. You know what I'm know saying? Know somebody like, wouldn't want to work with Eddie Murphy. Like even you know what I'm saying. He reach out. You going You know. You know his background. You know what he did. Like you know what I'm saying. So somebody gonna want to plug in, and you know what I'm saying. So it's different for him. Do, do, I wonder think, if it, is it gonna be as good as the the. Yeah, old? yeah, yeah. No, yeah. because you gonna then, have a uh, Cindy Hall in it. No, 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 this in here, you oh, know, no, Beverly Hills Yeah, so he, he's going to have them two old cops in there. The two original yeah, cops, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. a couple of them still alive he's going to have yeah, in there. Yeah, but they're right. old now. Right. Yeah, but is there, let me ask you this. You, I got to hook up three. I don't know if he's doing that. I got to hook up three. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> what the, 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 the throwaway cell phones or whatever, the burner phones and all that, we... We gotta get something for the culture, babe. Yeah, man, well, we got two out. P need to come on with it. We need three. Yeah. Let, nope. Yeah, if he come with a third one, you'll get out? If he reach out to me. <laughs> you know? And he's talking right? You know? <laughs> you growing as a as an actor, though, yeah. in certain roles. Like, can you understand, like, Ice Cube came out here recently, and he was like, you know, he gonna do a, he gonna do another Friday. Right, right, right. So, I mean, some of those actors have grown. Like, when you know how Chris Tucker did it, he wasn't trying to go back. He was dealing with Jackie Chan. Mm -hmm. Like, do you understand when somebody starts to evolve how it can be a complicated matter to go back to those roles because yeah. of where you're at in life and because of your, not only your value, but right. your time? Right, right, right. Yeah, no, nah, it definitely could, you know what I'm saying? but. That's why you just gotta pick your battles. You gotta pick the right stuff to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, you gotta go back, but how far are you going back? You know what I'm saying? Like, like I, I, I'm gonna work with all my people because fuck, he even gave me my 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 stepping stone to get to where I'm at right now. You know what I'm saying? Put me out there, show my face, and introducing me introducing me to the world. You know what I'm saying? So you know, I always work with him. What did he say to you that was that sticks with you to this day? Master P said something. Cause y'all was together a lot. Don't stop. Yeah, now nah, he just, you know, he just he brought me around. I just saw he like he hustled. He just showed you. He get up like he don't got nothing. Like he get up, he like he'll tell me, like, man, don't worry about what we did 20 years ago. We doing this right now. So he always has some type of business venture. He wake up and P gonna do something. So, always. You know what I'm saying? It's like it don't stop. It don't matter what you have, where you done been, where you at now, where you living there, like he wake up like he just started. He just you know what I'm started. saying? So that just kind of pushed me. It's like, all right, the grind don't stop. Yeah. It gets harder. Like, you know what I'm saying? Because it gets harder once the, the higher you get, 
it gets harder. Like you can't do regular stuff. I can't just go get a regular job. Yeah. Like yeah. I gotta hustle. I gotta hustle. Like, and that's that what it is. <laughs> what is the craziest thing that happened like if somebody it, like when you out and somebody walked up to you and like, man, I admire you. Mm -hmm. Or, you know, as far as on an actor level, somebody who's seen you that was an actor right. or actress that came up to you and was like, man, they've seen you and they just approach you. Right. When has that happened that where it, you still jog in your memory? Like, damn, that happened for me. Uh, with, with an actor? Yeah. Uh, honestly, actress. on a... On a, on a set, on a set of, all the sets I go on were really sacrificed because I, I was really around people that been in the game mm -hmm. and that I saw since a kid that's from Sopranos and all this and like, I'm like, man, like, I'm just like, I'm working with this dude and he'll stop, like, he'll stop and come talk to me like, man, I like what you're doing. Wow. We, I'm a fan of yours. Like, my my wife love you, let's call my wife. I'm like, man, this this man is a, you know what I'm saying? He like, we love you, we like what you're doing. So. It, that just kind of pushed me like, all right, I'm I'm in the right direction. Wow, that's that's amazing. Like, bro. yeah, I mean, I got a lot of like a lot of love from a lot of the big names that I did stuff with because I built a relationship. Like most actors, when I be on set, nobody outside. Yeah, they're in a trailer. Like I'm outside. I talk to every single person. I build a relationship with everybody from makeup, crane operators, people who build the sets, the directors. Like I go talk to everybody. And I just build that relationship with them. So it's like, now nah, it's like, they got, you know what I'm saying? Like good intentions, uh, try to put me on game or just give me that inspiration. Like, man, just keep doing what you're doing. You got it. You know what I'm saying? From who played Pinky, like that's my dude. Like yeah, he come, yeah, I bring yeah, yeah, him yeah, out, yeah. show him out. Like, I hear some good stories about nah, him. He, he, he cool, man. He real cool, bro. I like, think it was Brandon T. Jackson that came on and he spoke about him yeah, as he, well, said that he would, like when he called him, he came right yeah. on. It wasn't no big deal about the money, just because he put right. his own budget. For yeah. Clifton Powell, shout out to Clifton Powell, by the way. Um, I don't know the cameras. They my, all, uh, you can look straight my, ahead. My great close up, but um, <laughs> this one's too close. These two are, are the money shots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Clifton. Clifton will take a $5,000 movie and act like it's a $100 million movie. That's hard. I like it. And I love that he gives every energy to. Uh, a movie that could be considered grassroots. Yeah. That a producer might never done a camera, never done nothing before. He might have like like five dollars, ten dollars. Give him like Leo, shoot me out in two days. Wow. I'm, I'm like what? Two days. You got two days. This much money. Wow. Man, we shot Clifton out on that movie so quick, and he was such a pleasure to work with. Wow. And we had some chicken after we 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 went to the bar, we chilled. That's my brother right there. I we had some drinks, it, we had some shots, Brothers. had some lemon pepper wings. Come on now. And we had a great time. Shout out to Clifton Powell. He in Hollywood in no yeah, type of way. Like, like, he a real what's that Cliff, is it Clifton Powell. Clifton Powell. He, he a yeah. real person. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like he's solid. Like the, the roles you'll see him act, that's him. Yeah. Like that's him. Like he crack up. He, he gonna make a joke right before we we uh we bought the film like we had a film a funeral scene and he cracked the joke and now like everybody supposed to be sad and he just joking out so like he cool man like all the actors I've met man just been real people I ain't never really run into no no booze you you know what I'm yeah, saying yeah person like I ain't cause I ain't I but come you, at him as you, a fan but you a bad boy though see that what you not getting they probably could pull that on somebody else but you I got this know, distinct man. look. And you put your work in and you serious about your acting. And you, you can tell. And, oh, yeah, and I don't yeah. think it's going to be no easy win coming at you like that because right. we don't know what the hell you're going to do. Right. I'm sitting back and I'm like, I'm trying to figure it out. Boy, right. I, I hit Bob, man. Where he said, man, I got to holler at him, man. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we going to talk.